what is up youtube it's your girl tony square bringing you guys another video and today i'm showing you one of the most cracked out loadouts for warzone i'm telling you right now this is gonna bring you to every win you can possibly think of let's get into it so first off let me just talk about this real quick these guns are both Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War weapons. They're not modern warfare weapons, and this is because new weapons in the war zone means they have to be tweaked before, you know, they're on the same level with all the other guns. So, I for this setup, I chose the Krieg and the AK-47U. These two guns really are the top of Cold War, so it makes sense that they're the top of war zone as well. Now, for the Krieg, we have a few things that make sense, and a few things that I kind of threw on there, just as like a you know, my playstyle. Well, first off, you have the muzzle, which is the agency suppressor. This is kind of like the monolithic suppressor. It keeps your noise down so people can't hear you. You don't want people hearing you and knowing where you're at. So that's important. And next is the 17.7 .7 Ranger barrel. That is for a little bit more distance. It helps, trust me. Um, you definitely want that with the range, especially if you're not running a sniper. If you're going to run the AK-47U on top of it, you need the range, right? Um, the underbarrel, uh, SFOD grip. That thing, it really, it really keeps control. It helps a little bit. Um, I don't have, I don't have an optic on this one. That's because of the way I play. But you could easily switch out the SVOD grip for optic if you wanted to. But that's just personal choice right there. And for ammunition, I have the Salvo 60 round fast mag. This is you have more ammo. Definitely need it in war zone, especially when you're shooting at longer distances or you have a few. If you're pulling up on a squad, you need those bullets because you really don't have the time to reload. And then for the rear grip, you have that. SASR jungle grip. This is pretty much self-explanatory. It's just this build right now. It's crazy. You guys will see it later in the video. But I just, I it it fries. It fries. It literally, it's 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 better than Kilo in my opinion. Next we have the AK-47U build. Now this one is still a little bit of a work in progress, but I believe that this is probably the best it's gonna get. Um, you want the mono, you want the Right now I have the sound suppressor on because I don't have the agency suppressor unlocked, but once you get the agency suppressor, pop that on there. That does way more that does way better than the sound suppressor. Because you don't want people hearing yet when you shoot, right? You got the barrel, cavalry lancer, kinda cancels out the the damage reduction reduction of the sound suppressor. You definitely need that. Um, for stock, have a tactical stock. You just need it for a little bit of mobility. You know, you, you're gonna be up close in people's faces. You want to hit those shots. Um, ammunition. I got the 40 round speed mag. That's just a personal thing. Uh, rear grip is speed tape. Just you know, self-explanatory again. Really need that. You know. So if you guys may notice, I do have a couple games in here, but the main one is this win. We got a win with this setup. I was playing duos with a friend of mine. We were just uh, honestly, we were just killing it. We were killing it. We were vibing. Um, there's, you know, it, it's definitely good for up close and personal. It's also good for a little bit of long distance shooting the Krieg. Uh, definitely it's a good counteractive. You can kill multiple people at once because if, you know, you run out of bullets with the Krieg, you can easily switch over to the AK-47U. Um, you know, you could just vibe with it. You know what I'm saying? You, you can just vibe and really it, there is no recoil. Honestly, there's pretty much zero recoil on the Krieg with that setup. Which makes it really, really good for gunfights, especially late game when you need to just beam everybody because, you know, you got the crack people in the last circle. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure you hit that like button. And if you want to see more videos from me and more classes, hit that subscribe button, turn post notification on because I post videos very frequently. And you make sure you want to know when I post one, right? Right? Right. Alright guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.